If you're asked to write the number 6.5 as a fraction, here's how you do it. What we can do is consider this to be 6.5 over 1. Because we're just dividing by 1, it's still 6.5, but now we have the start of a fraction. We need to get this 6.5 to be a whole number. And the way we can do that, since we have just one decimal place here, we can multiply it by 10. So when we multiply the numerator, the 6.5 times 10, that gives us a whole number, 65. But we can't just multiply the numerator. We also need to multiply the denominator by 10. That's because 10 over 10, we're just dividing 10 by 10, it's 1. When we multiply by 1, we don't change the value, just the way it's represented. 10 times 1, that's 10. So 6.5, the number, equals the fraction 65 tenths. We can reduce this, so we can simplify this. Let's do that. 5 goes into 65 and into 10. So 5 times 13 is 65, and then 5 goes into 10 two times. 2 times 5 is 10. So we end up with 13 over 2. So 65 tenths, we can simplify that to 13 over 2. This is an improper fraction. The numerator, it's larger than the denominator. So let's change it to a mixed number. So 2 goes into 13 six times with 1 left over. And then we just bring the 2 across. So 6 and 1 half, the mixed number, that's equivalent there to 13 over 2. So the decimal, 6.5, equals the fraction 13 over 2, or 6 and 1 half. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.